Hi, I'm Jim Major, the Highway and Utility Superintendent for the City of Concord. And we're here today to talk about the Fall Leaf Collection Program, specifically the bulk collection. Uh, this year it's going to start on November 2nd, and if the weather permits, we're going to go through December 11th. Like everything else this year, COVID-19 has affected the way we're going to be able to pick up leaves this year. Unfortunately, we're not going to be able to do the social distancing with our normal vacuum, so we've had to go to a leaf loader, which we have right here today. Uh, as you can see with a leaf loader, we've got to have the leaves out into the street so that we can pick them up, uh, almost windrowing like snow. We won't be able to get leaves that are behind the curb or behind the sidewalk, so it's important to get the leaves out into the street in a windrow versus piles if you can. Also avoid having uh, any leaves piled around mailboxes, telephone poles, or any other obstructions that may be in the, in the way. During leaf collection from November 2nd to December 11th, we're asking folks not to park on the street from 7 a.m. to 3 p.m. to allow the equipment to be able to get to the leaves. Uh, again, this year we'll have three crews. One will start at the Bowtown Line and work north. The second crew will start at the Blossom Hill Cemetery and work north into Penacook. And the third crew will start on Mountain Road at, at Fairview and work their way south on the east side of the river. We work on the enclosed drainage system first before we get out into the country areas. We're also asking folks to get their leaves out as soon as they can on November 2nd in order not to miss the program. So it's important to get your leaves out the first part of the leaf collection because uh, it varies on the amount of leaves that they are, the weather, all kinds of factors that makes it difficult to predict exactly where we're going to be. So to avoid not missing out on the uh, leaf program, we ask that people get their leaves out as soon as possible. Unfortunately, we only have one chance to get around, so it's important to get your leaves out at the beginning of the program. The only area that the city does plan on picking up a certain day is on Veterans Day, uh, November 11th, up around the high school area. We do this in order to be able to get in and around where the uh, students usually park, and that's the one day that we send out the crews to that one particular area. And you can view a map of this area online on our webpage. We also have a sector map, which shows the three crews what area is there to be picking up. It doesn't show where they picked up, but it shows where they will be. We also have a third map, which is called the Fall Leaf Collection Map, and that's updated daily, so you can see where crews have been. This will give you a rough idea when they may get into your area to make sure that you have your leaves out. We understand that bulk leaf collection has its challenges, such as the leaves haven't fallen as the crews start the program, as well as early onset of winter, which could cease the program, and the unpredictability of when we'll be by to pick up the leaves. We also understand that it's a very popular program, and in order to try to keep it fair for everybody, we alternate crews every year of where they start. I want to remind residents that bulk collection is based on weather, and an early onset of snow could end the program. We ask residents to keep an eye on the weather as the program continues, and to not lose out on leaf collection is to take advantage of the bag program and get your leaves into bags, and they'll be guaranteed to be picked up this fall. Hi, my name is Adam Clark, Administration Division Manager for the City of Concord. I'm here today to talk to you about the Bag Leaf Collection Program. The Bag Leaf Collection Program will be running for three weeks. It'll start November 23rd and run through December 11th. With this collection program, leaves should be placed in biodegradable yard waste bags or in rigid containers marked leaves for collection. Leaves should be placed at the curb by Monday at 7 a.m. regardless of your trash day. Leaves may be collected on a different day than your trash and recycling. Bag leaf collection will run for three weeks. It'll be the weeks of November 23rd, November 30th, and December 7th. This collection program provides for guaranteed collection. It's more predictable and it's not weather dependent. Residents could also mulch their leaves into the lawn with the lawnmower. They could find a local accepting farm to take them or drop them off at the Gelinas Earth Materials Recycling Center down on Fort Eddy Road. Leaf drop off there is accepted free from residents with an ID or they can also accept brush and branches, items that aren't accepted in the city's leaves collection program for a nominal fee. Please remember that the bulk leaf collection program is weather dependent, so residents are encouraged to bag their leaves to guarantee collection. The bag collection program will run through December 11th. For more information, frequently asked questions, detailed maps, and a video of the leaf loaders, visit concordnh.gov slash leaf collection.